Earlier this week in New York City, the NHL Board of Governors met to discuss the state of the league as the new season approaches. NHL Commissioner Gary Bettman provided an update on salary cap projections, which always generates interest among teams and fans alike. The current NHL salary cap sits at $88 million, and Bettman shared that the early projection for the 2025-26 to season is $92.5 million, a slight increase from the previous estimate of $92 million. While the salary cap would likely have surpassed $100 million by now, the COVID-19 pandemic had a severe impact on the league and its players. During the shortened 2021 season, which featured just 56 games, players received their full salaries, leading to a significant escrow debt owed by the NHLPA. That debt has since been paid off and things have returned to normal. With anticipated cap increases in the coming seasons, teams have already started handing out large contracts. It wouldn't be surprising to see the cap reach $100 million within the next two to three years. The Edmonton Oilers, for example, signed Leon Dreisaitl to an eight-year, $112 million contract carrying a $14 million annual cap hit. Meanwhile, they'll need to negotiate with Connor McDavid after his contract expires following the 2025-26 to season, likely giving him a raise from his current $12.5 million cap hit. The Maple Leafs and Mitch Marner will look to negotiate a new contract after this season, with Marner expected to receive a raise from his current cap hit of nearly $11 million. In addition, Rangers goaltender Igor Shesterkin is reportedly seeking a significant payday, aiming to reset the goaltending market with an annual salary in the $12 million to $13 million range on his next deal, with the collective bargaining agreement set to expire next September. Both the league and the NHLPA hope to begin negotiations early in the new year and finalize a new agreement by season's end. Let me know your thoughts on the NHL salary cap projections in the comments below. Do you think we'll see the salary cap hit $100 million in the next few years? And how will this impact player contracts moving forward? Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the channel for more NHL updates. See you in the next one.